I want to show you how I stretch before getting on the chairlift some stretches and some rotations to get your body warm up and prepping for the slopes so the first one is with your arms a little bit cross and then some rotation movements going forward and then going back the other arm forward and then to the back okay like to do this one too you take your elbow and push it to your neck don't be so hard with this you don't want to hurt yourself before anything so be careful when you do stretches okay another one that it's important if you are a snowboarder you are always like you have your body and then you have to turn your head and this is the right position to know why so it's important to be aware of the neck so I like to just put my hand on the front and press it through the hand but don't do it too hard it's like you put your head like this way and your hand this way don't do it too hard and then to the other side and then to the front you go with your head to the front and with your hand to the back be careful don't do it too hard please and then some neck movements this, this don't do it too quickly because you can hurt yourself so please and to the front, to the back to the front, to the back and then a little bit of rotation if this rotation is hurting you, don't do it. Do it slowly. It's normal to to feel the crack a little bit if you aren't if you aren't in a warm up yet. To the other side. And, then, and that's it for the neck. And then you can move forward your leg. is hurting you don't do it you have to feel your body but it's good to stretch before do, doing anything this type of then some rotation of your hips and we are always getting this for granted but it's really important to move your hips around because when you are snowboarding you are always rotating the hips so it's 
important to warm up your, your upper body and your lower body. And then the knees. Take your knees. Do it smoothly. Smooth rotations. Then to the other side. Another that I like to do with the legs is this one. In the front of you. To make your leg movements. Then the other. If you do it in a flat terrain, it's better. So don't do it like me. <laughs> Hold this pose for 10 seconds, maybe. The other leg. Okay. And another that I like to do first is this one. Put your knee, right when you do the toes, the toe side, and then stretch this foot, pointing the toe up and go low. Do it a few times. Then, the other leg. Like this. Okay, and that's it. These are all the stretches and rotations that I always do before getting up on the chairlift and hitting the slope so be safe and it's really important to warm your body up to make a better day for riding so guys i hope you like this video give me a thumbs up